Dinosaurs have captured people's imagination for decades. And with the help of the movie industry, these ancient beasts are even larger than life. 130 years of fossil exploration in Dinosaur Provincial Park, there have been over 400 complete skeletons pulled out, and as well as many other partial skeletons and individual bones from representatives of over, over 50 different species of dinosaur. So it's a really special place. David says Dinosaur Provincial Park has been ranked one of the top three locations in the world for excavating fossils due to a number of geological factors. He says during the Cretaceous period, this area had many rivers flowing through it, which provided a lot of food for the dinosaurs. When the dinosaurs died, the river sediment covered them and helped the process of fossilization begin. Then during the Ice Age, the glaciers scraped off the surface, allowing paleontologists to easily excavate the fossils. We have visitors coming to Dinosaur Park for a lot of reasons. So definitely we have a lot of people that want to come out here and they want to see fossils or even better, they want to find fossils. So we offer a number of programs that allow people to do that. At the park, they offer a variety of different educational opportunities to suit every visitor's age and interest. One of the unique programs is the guided excavation excursion to Bone Bed 30. So this is an example of what we can do as part of the guided excavation program. So we have members of the public come in and they get to participate in all aspects of excavation in a bone bed. So here we have part of the section of frill, so that's the part off the back of the skull of the ceratopsian. Right here there's a limb bone and then there's another limb bone under this part right over here as well. Participants use paleontologists' tools and techniques for excavating fossils. They work in a small team for up to three days to uncover fossils never before seen by human eyes. Uh, Bone Bed 30 is an opportunity for, for the members of the public to come out and try their hand at digging up dinosaurs in a real bone bed and they're using techniques that paleontologists and technicians use just like we've done for over a hundred years. The Royal Terrell Museum has a field station in Dinosaur Provincial Park. And according to David, the museum is using Bone Bed 30 in an ongoing research project which examines dinosaur skulls. I'm so excited about this program because it's, it's great to see the excitement on someone's face when they find you know, a fish scale or a tooth or uncover a new bone. They're just so excited and, and it's great to see that. Most of the park's interpretive programs run from Victoria Day long weekend until mid-October and advanced registration is recommended. From the Alberta Badlands, for Go on Shaw TV, I'm David G.